My name is Juliana May. I'm an author. I'm in a different setting today because I'm doing something different. I am trying to dye my hair with overtone. I actually am getting my aunt, who is a stylist, to try it with me because I thought I'd have a professional opinion. So we have the deep treatment mask and they threw in a travel bottle and a conditioner because I bought their combined package thing. And this is extreme purple. I bought two conditioners because if you spend over $50, you get free shipping, so I thought I'd do that. It's kind of a, just a plain box, and then I love this. <laughs> Let's take a hot shower together because you don't have to use cold water. You're supposed to preserve your hair color with cold water, but you don't have to with this, so that's really nice. Yeah, that's what it looks like. This is Welcome to the Coolest Color Club on Earth. We think you'll like it here. There's also a $10 coupon thing that I didn't know about, but I will generate one for you and put that in the description box. So Laura's going to cut my hair now and uh, see you in a minute. <laughs> So the beauty of this is it's got I, it's got a lot it's missing a lot of bad things for you and it's vegan. Okay. And you just put it in your hair. You you don't need a professional, but I thought it would be nice to have a professional because she's professional. You just put it in your hair, and then there's conditioner that um, when you condition your hair, it keeps depositing color so that your color lasts longer. So thought I'd try it. I have the darkest purple because I want to make sure it actually turns out purple. Cool. So you're supposed to have dry hair if you're first installing your purple color. Dry just helps it be better. So go ahead Laura whenever you're ready. You do have a lot of hair, so I'm hoping you have enough. You think I could use that whole tub? Mm -hmm. I hope not. <laughs> See, it's a good thing you're having a professional do it because yeah. I would just dig my hands in and rub it on. Well, you can do that. It's not, I don't know, you can. It's less professional that way, obviously, which is why I'm having a professional do it. And she's even got this tool brush thing that I don't even know what it's called. Now what are you doing? I'm coming through it. To make it even. Mm -hmm. See, this is why we had Laura do it. Yes, exactly. <laughs> what are you thinking of it so far? It's nice and creamy. Oh, well, that's always good. Yes. You need to have a swivel chair to bring you closer. And you're supposed to leave this in for 10 to 15 minutes. Before and the broom that's on the floor. <laughs> and the pile of hair that's in the corner. And you're supposed to put the conditioner in and leave it in for three-ish minutes, I think. Do you advise I wash my hair less or more? What's it recommending now? It, I think you just do daily, probably, or I don't know. I don't really know. Because you say that I should like skip at least a day or two before. Yeah. I'd probably just keep doing that. I think you should do your normal. Yeah. I'm not really putting this in very professional right now. Oh, yeah. Sure. have like really awesome I sections and. Yep. Whatever. Oh, I see. So you're you're highlighting certain parts. Well, see, but I'm kind of just like getting. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, this stuff smells amazing. Does it? Yeah. I think it's supposed to be like a mask, you know, to use in the shower as well. Maybe. Probably use it. Well, obviously, I think less than the conditioner because you're supposed to leave it in for 10 to 15 minutes. If I don't use the whole tub in one shot, anyway. Is it looking like I am? I mean, that's alright. I guess if I do, I just wasn't expecting to. It was $47, I think, for that. A full-size conditioner, and they included a travel-size conditioner as well. Because of the the belt. So, so that's not bad, right? It's a pretty good price. I'm gonna play with the cat. What do you have? corner of my eye what I can see. Yes. Let's see how much she used. So that's like half of the thing, right? Yeah. For half of my head. I have a lot of hair though. A lot of hair, my friends. Well, I painted it in so it's not on all the way to your scalp. 
so we will have depth and dimension. All right. You're just gonna like it. I'm sure I will. It's purple. So this is the conditioner. This is a daily conditioner. I'm probably not gonna do daily because I don't wash my hair daily, but it says to use gloves and put a generous amount into wet hair, especially after shampooing. For even brighter results, apply on dry hair. Either way, you're supposed to let it sit three to five minutes before rinsing clean. Good morning! <laughs> so I thought I'd wait to finish this video up until after, um, after the night had passed, then it wasn't dark anymore. In other words, I wanted to wait until morning for daylight so you can see what it looks like in the daylight. I'm not sure what the lighting was like in last night's video. So, and, and anyway, this is much better lighting, I'm sure. I think it turned out fantastic. I love it. I'm, between the cut and the color, I'm just, I'm over the moon. <laughs> I was worried that it wasn't gonna be as purple as I expected or hoped it to be because um, it wasn't dye. <laughs> and hold on, that's my mother. Hello? Hello? Hi. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, I was surprised at how well this turned out. This, I think it looks great. And my hair wasn't like, I think it was pretty blonde, but it wasn't like super bleached. So I'm pretty happy with how well the color turned out. It just, I'm just really surprised and excited by how well that it works. Because to be honest with you, I was prepared to have my aunt go out and buy some actual dyes so that I could have my hair purple. It's a real contrast me because my hair has not been this dark for a very long time. The last time it was this dark was when I had it purple. Um, the last time, which was a couple years ago now. Milano, you were being so loud and interruptive. My friend, can you? Anyway, it's been really blonde the last couple years at least. It's been really blonde and now there's no blonde and it's really weird. But I love it. It's really nice. It's just so dark. But the last time I got purple, I was immediately so happy. Like, I'm pretty sure there's never, I'm never more happy about a color than when I have it purple. Like, I'm just so instantly like, ah! <laughs> like, even when I've done it other colors, it's just like not insta-love, you know? It's like, purple and I just have insta-love. I don't know. So I'm really excited. I ended up just having my aunt rinse out my hair. She didn't put the conditioner in it last night because the mask or treatment, deep treatment, whatever it's called, it just says to rinse it out. It doesn't say like you have to wash it. And so we just, we just did the deep treatment, but I'll be using the conditioner. And I guess, I guess you can stay tuned to my videos if you want to see how long the color lasts. I do have to, two bottles of conditioner, and I have a little travel, whoop, the box almost fell off my bed, and I have travel conditioner, which is going to be coming in handy. I still have, like I said last night, half of the deep treatment left, so I could use the deep treatment again, and, you know, between all of this color, I should, I should be purple for a while. I'm, I'm really happy with how it turned out. So yeah, I think this has been a great overtone experience. I was really, I heard about it and I've been excited to, I wanted to try it for months. My cousin even was like, hey, you should check this out because she knows how much I love dyeing my hair, so. And she met somebody who liked it and who used it, you know. So now I've tried it and I do love it. I, the, it's so cool, <laughs> it's awesome. I'm really surprised that it works this well. So let me know what you think of my purple hair. I will be back soon with another video. I don't know what yet. I think I'm gonna have this one out before my author update at this point. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my experience with Overtone. Like I said, I'll leave a referral thing because uh, I didn't realize they had referral things when I ordered or else I could have gotten $10 off of my order and given someone else $10. So you can get $10 and give me $10 instead. How about that? <laughs> they have a pretty cool reward system, like Monk just changed up their reward system. I'm sure a lot of companies have reward systems like this, but the Monk is the only one that I know of. It's like, however much you spend, you get, you get points for it. I mean, a lot of places do that. It just reminded me of Monk's setup. 
So yeah, and it's like you just register and then you get this these reward points. So it's pretty cool. You don't have to get like a credit card or anything like that. You just you just buy color and they're like, thanks, here's some rewards. <laughs> That's the best way I can explain it. Anyway, thank you so much for watching again. <laughs> See you. Bye. Is it playing? It's We're playing. playing. Asher. Are you sure? Shut up! Asher. Asher. Is it still going? A mm -hmm. Asher's recording me now. Okay. <laughs> You're supposed to preserve your hair color with cold water. Now oh, there, recording. now I am. Now, I hope you recorded last time. <laughs> Asher, can you please be quiet? Thanks. Can you take it far away? I should take the... Did you want me to record? Yeah. I'll probably just like speed it up and have um, music playing unless we say something amusing or, oh, okay. or something. <laughs> something important. Something important. Yeah. I have too much hair for that clip. <laughs> Child! In the corner, <laughs> far away. Hi, kitty. Can you see the kitty? I see the kitty's backside. Hi, kitty's backside. <laughs> there he is. Hi. Hi, kitty. <laughs> like, yeah, okay, whatever. <laughs> Not interested. He checks it out. He keeps going. Mm -hmm. That's what it. That, so that's what it's gonna be. weird. I have it shifted over a little bit more than usual. Anyway. Hi, my name is Juliana May. Um, oh, no, I already introduced this video. Oh my gosh. I'm just so used to introducing when I'm sitting in front of my camera like this. Okay, I don't need to introduce. Okay, let's move on.